MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news, reviews, events and special offers via video media. Philippe, this Willerman machine is a slightly different concept to most machine tools. What, what actually is it and what does it do? Actually, we developed that 308 B machine uh, especially for dental labs. I mean, obviously, dental labs, they were looking for a very compact, small machine, uh, having a dimension to be loaded and go into a standard size, door size, I have to say. That's, so that's why the machine we, has been developed to go into a door uh, 800 millimeter wide. Yeah. And then we developed the machine uh, with different features, with a combination what makes the machine very unique. We combine bar stock machining for implants and chuck machining from the disc, for example. That's a good point. So on, on, on the bar machining, you would have a bar feed on this machine, but you've also got a chuck as well. So you'd be bar feeding the material, machining, and then is there a secondary operation with the chuck? Effectively, I mean, in terms of uh, bar stock machining, we have uh, the main operations front. Uh, we cut the components from the bar stock. And then we have on the machine a device allowing you, allowing us to grab the component before cutoff operation and do secondary operation after cutoff operation. That's a light finishing operation to get the parts finished out of the process. Okay, and it's pretty fast looking at the machine moving around here. Now, what, what are we talking in, in terms of the speed of the machine, the spindle, the axis movement? Actually, the, that uh, type of machine requirements from the market is not really the speed. Uh, I mean, uh, acceleration and speed, but uh, requirements from the market are five axis capability, bar stock machining, disc machining, and obviously the size of the machine was a very important criterion. That, that, that's, that's the, I'm, I'm sensing now it's the second time you've mentioned that, so it's a big, it's a big factor. Machining uh, complex parts and producing uh, components in a small footprint. Mm -hmm. Another ma major point, uh, I mean, requested from the market was a, as well a machine capable to machine, uh, let's say, hard material. Most of, uh, more and more of the components are coming out from uh, titanium or cobalt chrome material and we must have a rigid machine to cut difficult material. And the machine is built as a very solid, rigid machining center. So it offers to our customers a production machine. And we talked about size of the machine as well, but what, to, to sort of finally touch on, on the size of the parts, how, how big a parts would you be machining in here? Well, basically, if we are looking to bar stock machining, the machine, we can cut components out from a 27 millimeter diameter. Okay, so that's the maximum bar diameter. That's the maximum bar stock diameter. Okay, and in the UK moment, in the UK market, Adriano, if, you might be able to give us a little bit more information about the UK market because you head up sales around uh, the UK and Europe. How, what sort of markets do you see this machine going into? For this machine, 308B, 308 S, uh, we see a great op opportunity in the dental, medical market. So, with and with with the 308, what's the difference between the 308 and the 308 S? 308B is a typical bar stock machine, 308S is a machine dedicated for uh, milling from a disc. And who would supply us with this machine in the UK? Well, the supplier for this machine in the UK will be KL Machine Tools and with the support of Mil Wilhelmin Makodel, uh, Switzerland. Great, thank you both for your time, thank you. Yeah. For more videos, products and news, go to mtdcnc.com or follow MTD Online on Twitter.